Oh my god! What's up guys? Just got here like five minutes ago and we got a Bart, Bart sand bass. So that's just a start. Stay tuned. Alright guys, we're gonna release this little beauty. Alright, good. Ugh. All right, let's see what this is. It's a shark? I don't know, it's big. Oh! Oh, oh, oh! Wow! 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 That's a big bass! Let's get a measurement on this guys, official measurement. Whoa. 15 14. 15 14. Get a clean measurement. 15. 15 inches guys. 15 inches. That's a nice fish. That's a keeper. That's a keeper in every state. <laughs> <laughs> it's coming in pretty mellow. A little head shake right there. Oh, it's a oh, it's a leopard shark. <laughs> leopard shark. Today was really good, guys. I landed a big bass. It's a Bart sand bass. It's a really nice Bart sand bass. It's actually about 16 inches. Um, we're gonna do a catch and cook. I'm gonna deep fry it again. The Cajun seasoning and breading. And it's gonna be really good so stay tuned for the catch and cook all right guys we're gonna start with filleting the fish so let's go ahead and cut it right behind the pectoral fin right there All right, guys, so here we have our two boneless, beautiful fillets. All right, guys, we're also gonna fillet the croaker. I got one side filleted. There's the fillet. I got the skin off. So as you can see, a smaller croaker almost has the same amount of meat as a big, large bass. Alright guys, I got some of my Louisiana fish fry here. Now I'm going to add some Old Bay seasoning into the mix. Actually, I'll go ahead and mix these up just like that. Get it all in there. Beautiful. So the two big 
fillets are are the bass and the two smaller ones are the crawfish. Alright guys, guys, here it is. We got the croaker and the bass sandwiches. We got the bass here, the croaker on this one. I got the bass here and the croaker on this one. We're gonna try it out. We'll try out the bass first. See how the bass is. Bass is pretty good, guys. The bass was really good. Really good stuff. My first time trying a uh, barred sa sand bass. This was really good, guys. It's great A meat. Now we're gonna go for the croaker sandwiches, which I've already done before. So Eric's gonna try it out. Wow. In my opinion, honestly, guys, croaker's way better. I like the way meat. better as a fish. The, the meat is more firm. It's got a harder texture to it. It has absolutely no flavor. Croaker is an excellent frying pan fish, honestly. Thanks for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed this session of Catch and Cook. Stay tuned. We'll have some more videos up soon. And we're going to try to go after some big predatory fish now since we have the gear. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to make sure to put the subscribe and the like button. All right. Take care.